analyst meeting, but this one works to illustrate the, the concept the that if someone says, so what are you trying to do? You know, I don't quite get it. Say, well, we're creating the desktop of the future. And actually, the desktop of the future is a little misnomer because it could be a TV set as well, ultimately. But what is happening is that people want to be able to experience something over what you would have called an IP network at their desktop, and eventually if we have a set-top box, it would be as a TV set, that is informative. And so the end user is used to, on a local area network, being able to get that content fast. So if you use the benchmark of a local area network and a response time at the screen at a local area network as what everybody wants to have, regardless of where the content is, what we're doing is enabling an end user to click on something and go across the land to a server, go out in the street, across town, to another location where a server is, and get at that content or that information in a sub-second response time way so that it feels like it's all local. And ultimately, if they want to go across country, uh, which they will, then they're going to want to be able to get that content also in a sub-second response time way, which means it's fast and it feels local. Now. Um, that's not possible over the internet, and so what we're doing is wiring around all the problems associated with that in making it possible for an end user who is sitting at their desk to click on something, whether or not they're at home or at work, and get that information in a sub-second response time way or fast, uh, regardless of where that content is. So this is another way of telling at a high level our story about what it is that we're doing now, there's a lot of technical things that those little blue and red and yellow lines represent that those other movies are about. It's like, how do you do it? So there's the what you're doing, and then there's how you do it. And depending on the target audience you're talking to, you may have to flip back and forth between those things. Um, because some end users, I mean, some people you'll be talking to, understand what it is they want to do. They just don't know how you're going to make it possible. Others are going to want you to illustrate to them what is possible with the services that we bring to the table. And that's part of the problem of pioneering a market. I mean, we are, let's not forget, we're changing the industry, we're changing the world. When you do that, you will have a whole gradient of people with a different knowledge base and experience. And so uh, what we're trying to do is make it possible for you as a salesperson to on the fly in front of an audience figure out their knowledge kind of by the feedback and the questions and then flip to what's important. So if they need a really technical story told, you can do that. If they need a um, conceptual story about what are, you, what are you doing, then we're going to have that. This environment that we've created here will hopefully never, it will never stop being added to.